and we might need to send out a new notification that I'm streaming again. Well, over before it started, RIP in peace. Yeah, I'm really sorry. <laughs> I'm really sorry. Um, we're trying again. My settings were not good. So, I, I lowered everything, I think, and, um, we're, we're better now, I think. So, let's, uh, send this out again to share my link again. Second, second try. Tweeting. Okay, we're back. Um, okay, so, uh, please let me know if this is any better. Um, nope. Okay, it seems to be working fine now. Okay, thank you. Hello, everybody. Hi, Tim. Hi, Conrad. Hi, Baltan. Thank you for being here. Um, it's going now. It's going now. It's fine. We're here. Hi, Efren. Oh, it's, yes, it's back. It's back. Hi, Biker Boy. I hope it's better. Okay, so here's, here's my stream. Um, we're live here, and I'm going to play some of these new decks. Now, I've already imported a bunch of decks. If you'll notice, there's some recurring color themes here, but I picked decks that I feel like I would want to play. So, oh, hi, Jake. Hi, thanks for being here. I'm so excited. So, first thing... The first thing that I'm seeing, I have a serious, serious issue with. I've got two decks here that have both, they both have the same picture on it. So I immediately have to change that. Oh, hi, Rhino. Thank you for being here. What? Did I pick my nose on the stream? I didn't mean to. I'm really sorry. We'll edit that part out later. But... We can't because this is live. Okay, I've got to fix. Both of these have the same picture on them. So I've got to change one of them. I'm going to change this one, I guess. Um, this one's called Thick Angels. So I'm going to pick. We can't have the picture of Feather on it. We're going to have a different angel. I'm going to pick the Resplendent Angel. Um, okay, that's better. Okay, we're good now. None of our decks have the same picture, so we're good. Yes, there is a life gain aggro deck right there in the middle. Wait, which one's a which one's a pixie deck? I think they moved now. I don't know which one that you're talking about, Biker Boy. Oh, hello everybody. Thank you for being here. You didn't, okay, you didn't get to put your list together. That's okay. No problem. I got, I've got a bunch of, I've got a bunch of decks here to play. So what, what should I do first? I think I might do, um, I think I might do a sealed event. Oh, wait, I can't do a sealed event. I can't do a sealed event yet. What? What? This is, this is ridiculous. I'm just going to have to find a match and play because I can't do the sealed event yet. So which deck should I play? Oh, I, I was on top of a deck. Oh yeah, my picture. Okay, I didn't get it. Okay, um, let me pick a deck to play. Oh, hi, Eric. I'm doing a stream. Yes, it's, I'm very nervous. Did I pick a deck? Oh, wait, no, I didn't. Um, I'm going to pick, let's pick Mardu Aristocrats. How about that? 
Sparky's talking to me. Can you guys hear Sparky talking? Or not? I think I have the end game sound turned down. But I'm not sure if... I mean, I can hear it a little bit, but I'm not sure if you guys can hear it. Okay, let's try this. I've got to play a few games before I can do... Oh, we're playing against Petrify. I don't know who this is. Let's... Okay. And I, I have not looked, like, inside any of these decks, so... This looks good. Let's keep it. I think I'm gonna keep it. What does this do? Sacrifice a creature or planeswalker. Heartfire deals four damage to any target. Ooh. Okay. You only heard Sparky a tiny bit. Okay, good. I don't I don't think it should be too loud. Okay, we're keeping our hand. And we're gonna say hi to Petrify. Hi. Oh, Petrif Petrify is playing Selesnia deck. Um, I want to play my Footlight Fiend. I'm going to pay two life. And play my Footlight Fiend. And see if I can kill that bird. Somehow. Destroy Petrify. Yeah. I hope we destroy Petrify. Uh-oh. What's this? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Oh, no. We've got a bunch of flyers. So, this won't count. My Godless Shrine doesn't count for that, right? I'm pretty sure it doesn't. Okay, we're playing our Hero of Precinct 1. And... Attacking with all. Take that. Who's petrified now? Hold off on the fiend. Play after hero. Yeah. I'm going to get my heroes out there first. D does the full light fiend count as a multicolored creature, as a multicolor spell? I think it does, right? Hmm. But I, wanna, I do want to bolt that bird. Okay, that sounds good, Eric. Don't don't drive in YouTube. It's probably not safe. Oh no. What does proliferate mean? It means get some life back? It means put another counter on your creatures? It means I'm about to get wrecked oh no this is not good these should i should i should i heart fire one of these creatures um what does this do oh no i think i'm just going to attack with all first it adds another counter if it has a counter Oh no! Oh no, I'm taking too long! Oh gosh. Okay. Okay, first I'm going to attack with all. And see, let's see what Petrify does. <gasps> Petrify is petrified. Um, okay. So, we're gonna, we're gonna take, we're gonna let them take the damage. Now what should I do? I really need to kill one of these creatures. I should probably kill the, this one, right? Because it's the one that's proliferating. Deals three damage to any target and you gain three life. Oh, I can't do that. Um, but I don't want to sacrifice my creature. Yes, if you've got removal, use it. Use what? Um... Y'all are going to see how bad I am at magic. You really, really are. Target a creature. And I guess I'll sacrifice... Sacrifice a creature. I'll sacrifice my Footlight Fiend. And we'll do one damage to Petrify. Ooh. <gasps> oh, 
Oh, I can ca I can cast I can cast my other Footlight Fiend. Oh, and I got a human. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Y'all got it. You y'all are smarter than I am. Oh no, I'm down to nine. Uh oh. I think I'm gonna die. I think there's a good chance that I'm gonna die. Well, no, I don't have any more mana. I can't cast that. I don't want to do that. Um. Well, I'm just gonna. Um. Attack with all. Does this have lifelink? No. I don't know what to do. They're not blocking? Oh man. Uh Turret creature is plus two plus two until end of turn. I don't need that. Not really. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kill something else. Ugh. Maybe I should kill this lifelink creature. Sacrifice this. Uh, I'll just do one damage to them. Oh boy. Well, I think I'm dead. That's okay. I really want to do the sealed event, but I don't have it opened yet. Ooh. A Johnny. I'm going to say nice. Was that a Johnny very loud? It was loud for me. A Johnny is very cool. Hi, Z, loath, meek. Or maybe it's low the meek. I'm sorry. I've never done a stream before, so. I'm, I don't, I'm not good at it. <gasps> Ooh, Judith. Let's see. I just don't think I can come back for this, honestly. Come back from this. We'll just cast our Judith anyways. Oh, you don't hear the game sounds good. Uh, I mean, I can't block these flyers. I'm pretty much dead. So I'll just, I'll just all attack. Maybe, oh, whatever. It doesn't matter, I'm dead. I thought maybe I should attack a Johnny, but it just doesn't matter. I think maybe Petrify is going easy on me. Oh. Okay, good game, Petrify. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead. Thank you. I got my first defeat. Oh, but I leveled up, apparently. Whatever that means. What? What is this? What? Is this normal? Uh, sure. I'll upgrade my deck. Okay, just get me out of here. Get me out of here, Sparky. I still can't do the I still can't do the sealed event. <laughs> okay, let's play a different deck. No, I don't want to practice. Okay, which deck should I play this time? Um 
Thick angels may be fun, but I just don't know. Four colors, that's scary. Um, cavalcade might be fun. Um, Wars of Gods. You know what? I'm going to play this Esper deck. Esper Zombies. It's got blue in it. Yep, I'm going to do it. I clicked play. Okay, try again. Oh, Sahili, sorry. Oh, life gain aggro, sorry. We'll do it next. <laughs> we'll do it next. Okay. Wow. What? What? Oh, I really, I don't really like this opening hand. Um, but I guess I'll keep it. <laughs> the, the preview account has just a million gems. They give it to you so you can play all of the events as much as you want to. It's just like a part of the thing. Isn't it crazy? I guess we'll just enter tapped. Well, I can't do anything anyways. They're not really my gems, and I won't have them after this event. Ooh, a Liliana. All my cards are kind of expensive. I probably should not have kept this opening hand. <gasps> this is my friend! The Rex is six! Hello! Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm probably gonna get killed. Oh, look at his sleeves. I guess I can probably do that too. Okay, Eternal Taskmaster. Enters the battlefield tapped. Well, that sucks. Okay, let's play this one. Graveyard Marshal. <laughs> no, I didn't spend money. I did not spend money. Yeah, this Esper Zombies deck was like the only... I was trying to find find deck lists with colors I don't typically play, so they weren't all just like white and red and black. And, um... Ooh, let's play this Death Baron. <gasps> yes! do it all attack oh and anyways this is the only one this this was like the only deck I could find that was not a control deck with blue in it because I was like I don't want to play control I'm not good at it <gasps> Ooh, beautiful I'm gonna say nice I don't know if my friend realizes that it's me um, okay um I'm gonna cast this Enters the battlefield tap. Whenever it attacks, you may pay three. If you do return to a creature card from the graveyard to your hand. Um, okay, I guess I'll just attack with this one. Because it has death touch. Oh! Thyrixis 6 sent us. Hi! Oh, hi, Axel. Tell him I said hi, too. Oh, we got more spirits. I'm afraid I'm going to die. Dumb question. Streamers don't get to keep the cards, do they? No, unfortunately. I don't get to keep anything from this account. Which is very sad, because the account has every card unlocked. I guess I'll play this one, because it's my only option. <laughs> Okay, um, ooh, this has Death Touch. I guess I'll attack with this Death Touch guy. <gasps> oh, and I can bring something back. Wait, no, I can't. I don't have the mana. Ooh, this is awkward. Oh, and I have an exile. Oh, I, wait, I don't think I can do this. I don't have the mana. Why is this tricking me? I 
I can't do it. Okay. It was just weird. It was... Oh, Taysa. I'm gonna say nice to that, too. Oh, wow. I don't even care if I lose to this deck. I love it. Oh, boy. I've got a Doom Dissenter. Yay. Hi, Cody. Thank you for coming over here to say hi. Tell Thyrixis 6 that I said hi to. And I just love his deck. And I don't... I don't even mind to lose to it because it's just so good. Why does it make me do this? Stop! I can't do it. I can't do it. I don't have the mana. Stop tricking me. Oh no, he's going to sacrifice the Seraph of the Scales. And a Hunted Witness. Oh. Okay. <gasps> oh, wow. Oh, wow. That's a lot of... I'm going to say oops. That's a lot of spirits. I really like this deck. I haven't seen any of the new cards in it, though. I don't think. No, these are all old cards. But that's okay. I really like this deck that he's playing. And the sleeves that match, the Orzhov sleeves. Ow, no. I guess I'll block. Is this a trick? I don't want my Death Baron to get killed. I'll block one of these with this. And then I'm going to take 7 damage. Right? Is that right? Ah... Yeah. Hey, but I'm getting a zombie, and it'll be buffed by my Death Baron. Oh no, they all had Vigilance. Oh, that's right, Tessa does that. <gasps> oh no. Oh no. I guess I'll sacrifice these two. What? Ouch. Eric, I'm going to play for as long as I possibly can until I go to bed. So, all afternoon and evening. Well, it's a little late now. Wait! I can play Kaya's Wrath. <gasps> what? I only gained one life. Oh no. Oh no. Why is this happening? Stop it, Liliana, stop. O M G. Look how many cards he has. <laughs> uh Oh, no. Oh, I love Cruel Celebrant. That's a card I want. Yeah. Okay, well. Oh, no. He has to discard. Wait, did he discard? Oh, no. He's still casting stuff here. Am I milling him? He still has 29 cards. I'm not milling him. Oh my goodness. I think I helped him. I I thought I would get life oh on of, of creatures you controlled. Whoops. <laughs> Uh-oh. <gasps> Guess what? I can play my Liliana now. Should I do that or should I cast this Eternal Skylord? I'm asked to. Ooh. I could immediately minus four her. Um, yeah, but I think I would still die. I, I'd better do this.
Oh, I thought I would get two creatures. Not at one creature with two tokens. Yeah, I mean, I knew... I knew that's how a mass worked. I just didn't think about it. Oh no! Um, this has afterlife. This is a one one. Oh, they all create tokens. Okay. I'll just block this. And this, and I'll take four. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I love Cruel Celebrant. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I, I maybe have, I maybe have gotten his deck from Aether Hub. If that's the Orzhov God's one, I have that one that he made. Okay, get out of here. I don't, this screen freaks me out. I still can't do the sealed event. Ah, okay, we'll play another game. And a zombie with lifelink? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Why? I don't want to practice. Okay, I'm not gonna play Esper Zombies again. Um, I'll try Sahili's Explosion. I don't think I'm gonna like this deck, but it's fine. It's fine. We're gonna try it out. Oh, that is the Wars of God's deck. Okay, good. Oh, Therix is six. Hi, thank you for stopping by. Yes, that was fun. Um I just didn't know what half of those cards did, so. But that was fun, and I want to try that deck out. I do have it imported, the Orzhov Gods deck, so I will be playing that some later today. I'm trying to get to my sealed event, but I don't have it unlocked yet. Okay, so I don't, oh boy, what is this? What are these cards? Oh my gosh. Uh I think I I think I better mulligan. I'm I'm mulliganing. Oh, I got a card. I don't, I don't like this either. All these cards are too expensive. Okay, we're mu we're mulling to 5. Okay, this deck sucks. I have to keep this. No, I don't want this. I don't want Rao. <laughs> After this game, sure, I will play Feather. I will play the Feather deck, yes. Um, okay, I'm gonna play this, and I'm not gonna pay two life. How about that? Hello, great boomer. I don't, I don't know who this is. Oh, okay, I got another land. And I still can't do anything. Okay. Oh, we got some Amara going on. What's this? Interesting. Oops. Come on. I still can't cast anything. Oh, I don't have three. I don't have two red. Ow. Oh, no. I'm afraid those egg sandwich any target. I could kill this Amara. Should I do that? Uh, yeah. You know what? I'm going to do it. Select a value for X. Two. Target a creature. This one. I'm doing it. I'm doing it, everyone. Oh, this deck has blue in it. My opponent's deck has blue in it. Oh, no. Oh, I thought they were countering me. 
It's just a growth spiral. They're trying to find a counter spell is what they're doing. Oh, another growth spiral. Yay, I did something. Okay, but I need it. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. No. Not Teferi. We don't like Teferi. He's evil. He does evil things. Oh yay, a watery grave. I'm gonna have to pay two life for this one. Right? Because I want to put my Karn out there. I okay, I don't know what Karn does. Villa up to cards your library and opponent chooses one of them. Put that card in your hand, exile the other. Minus one, put a card. Oh boy. Okay, so I have to do. I have to. Oh wow, I was listening to him. You guys can't hear it because I turned the sound down, but I could. Okay, I guess I'm gonna do his plus one. Let's just do it. Here we go. Revealed cards. Okay. Hey! That... Why? Why? Why did my Ugin go away? No oh, Teferi. Oh, no. Oh, no! Oath of Teferi! We are in trouble. Also, this person's avatar is Teferi. This person so loves Teferi. We are in big trouble. Teferi says hurry. Look at this! Look at this! There's so many things over here that I, I have to like scroll through them. Oh no. I'm so dead. Oh no. And they're untapping lands. <laughs> Thank you for stopping by. Hope you can visit back later. Um, okay, I've got a Sahili now? Ooh, what does Sahili do? Create a 1-1 a one -one color servo artifact creature token. Target artifacts you control become copy of another artifact. But I don't have any artifacts! Oh gosh, I'm gonna cast this. Oh, it's, oh, it's a vehicle, and I don't have any creatures. Oh, I should have done, I should have done Karn's plus one first. Oh, wait. Okay. Hold on. Please don't time out on me. The exile the other with a silver counter on it. Put a card you own with a silver counter on into exile into your hand. Oh, duh. I'm so dumb. I'm just going to plus one. But I should have done that. I'm I'm not I'm not good at reading cards. You know what? I'm not done yet. You don't need a creature. Why? Yes I do. It has crew one. I do need a creature. The explosion does damage. Yeah, it says to any target. Good God, what is that? Kamal's Druidic Vow? Wow. The explosion says it, that it deals X damage to any target. But I don't have enough mana to kill the Teferi with it. Oh, Fibblethop. Or is it Fibblethip? I'm just gonna say nice, either way that it's pronounced. Your spells crew it. Oh, I just looked at the words crew one. I didn't look at what it does. Y'all know you're you're probably watching the wrong stream here because I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know how I'm not dead yet. I literally have no idea what I'm doing. <gasps> Lava coil! 
four damage to target creature. Okay, we can kill something. We should probably kill Amara. Or we can cast this. Or, oh, we should probably cast this. Or we can cast Expansion Explosion. <coughs> oh. <coughs> Sorry. Copy target instant or sorcery spell with converted mana cost four or less. You may choose new targets for the copy. Could I do that with my lava coil? Should I do should I kill something? <gasps> Stop! So do I need to cast my lava coil first? Err. Uh... Um, let's see. I need to, do I need to cast my lava coil first? Oh, no. Oh. I don't know how to make my expansion work. I'm really sorry. Oh, now it's a creature. Oh, I forgot to plus one Karn again. What else do I have exiled here? Oh my goodness. Okay. <gasps> Maybe I should do this minus two. Oh wait, did I do it? Um, okay, now I'm gonna cast this. Oh my goodness. Oh, hey, I could target... Wait, is this an artifact? Target artifact becomes a copy. Shh, stop. No! It timed out on me! Oh. I should not have picked this deck. Why is it making me resolve that? Oh, hi, Langalia. Thank you for being here. Um, I wish nobody was watching this game, honestly. It's so awful. I know, Efren, that was gonna be awesome and I timed out. Like, I don't know why the timer can't recognize that I'm actually doing things. Urgh! Why do I have to resolve this every time? I don't think this thing can do anything. Okay, yeah, cast it, Tezzerat, sure, go ahead. These planeswalkers are going to get so tiny over there. Uh, this person probably hates me. Okay, thank you, Rhino, for not watching, because this is embarrassing. <laughs> player, player, subject, live in the graveyard. Oh, pff, hey! What were they? Okay, I don't understand that card. I don't understand that card. Okay, fine. No problem. Take them. Okay. Please, honestly, this is... This game. I... I just want you to attack with all, and I won't block anything. Please. Oh, I love Bells and Lock. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm passing. He's a, he's such a fun card to play. Yeah, let's just resolve all. Anything you want to do, just do it. It's fine. I'm not even going to block. I'm not even going to block you. Okay. 
Okay, so you can do six, seven, eight, nine. You can do 10 damage to me. Come on, can't you get in one more damage and just end it right now, please? Oh, good lord. Okay. Okay, we're growth spiraling <laughs> over and over. It's fine. Um, yeah, let's just go for the attack here. Is it my turn? I don't want to have a turn. Why didn't you attack with anything, Great Boomer? I'll just pay two life. I just, I don't care. Uh, explosion does X damage to any target. Target player draws X cards. What can I kill? Can I kill something? Um, maybe I should try to kill this thing. Uh... Wait, okay, so I need... Oh, one, two, three, four. I can only do three damage. Err. What, what's going to happen if I click this? Oh, wait, I don't want to do that. Oh, you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to... um. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do it. Uh, target an artifact you control. Can I tar- is it- does this count? But is it- what's it gonna do? Um, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not sure what I did. Uh, I'm not going to attack. Okay, I'm ending turn. I can't. I can't. I just can't. <sighs> Alright. Why did one of my creatures go away? It only lasts until end of turn? Ugh, this is dumb. This is dumb. This is the worst game ever. I really want to concede, but I'm just going to let it go. You are to time itself. I got nothing here, Great Boomer. I got nothing. I know what must be done. So if you could just kill me. If you pardon my words, that would be great. All right. Yeah, I should have hit Teferi. No, I could have only done three damage, though. Yeah, that, that's, you got it. All right, let's get out of here. Good game. Yep. It was not a good game. I just I mean, I hate to concede just because it's like this special event. But this is getting a little ridiculous. So, yeah, I'm going to have to go. I'm honestly, this is getting ridiculous. Okay, I think I can do my sealed event now. Please? No, I don't want to do whatever that is. Ah, I can't! Oh wait, yes I can, yes I can, yes I can, yes I can. Okay. Okay, so all I can do is sealed War of the Spark. That's fine. Okay, I keep clicking that, but it's just doing the same thing. Okay, let's play let's play a sealed event. Um Okay. 
I'm going to click seal War of the Spark. I don't need to earn more gold. I have a million gems. Are you showing the purchases? Yes. Okay, let's do it. Here we go. We're gonna force Orzov somehow. Oh no, what is this? What is this? Okay. What is this? You may look at the top credit of your library anytime. Oh, okay, so maybe we can play black. Um, oh, I got more gems. Cool. All right, let's see what we have here. Oh, I got the wanderer. Oh, I got this zombie cat. Oh, I got Davriel. Oh, okay. Oh, I got D-Spark. Oh, yeah, I definitely. I think I need to play. Oh, I got Nahiri. <gasps> Ooh. Okay, I want to put Gateway Plaza in. Uh, I don't really want to play these green cards. Okay, I want to put D Spark in. Bolus's Citadel is dope. Yeah, but is it good in sealed? Is it good in limited? Because it's cool, but it's really expensive. You may look at the top cover library anytime. You may play top cover library if you cast a spell this way. Uh, pay life equal to its converted mana cost rather than paying its mana cost. I have to pay life? Ooh, do I have life gain? Okay, we're gonna try it. Um Okay, so we need so we need some life gain. Uh okay, no. First strike no. Oh well that gives me two life. Um Oh, we don't really have much life gain. Prevent all non-combat damage, that would be dope. Oh, I want to play that. Exile target creature, then proliferate. I don't want to do that. Um, do I have any good blue cards? No, I don't have any good blue cards. There's no good blue cards. Uh, let's see. I haven't played any limited in a long time. Yeah, I don't know how good this will be in sealed. But we're going to try it. We're just going to force it. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm not seeing any life gain, so maybe it'll just kill us. I, I thought I put D-Spark in here. Oh, I must have two. That's good. Um, I'm going to put Nahiri in there. Um, Emergence Zone? Hmm. I don't know about that. Okay, so I'm going to play white, black, and red. Okay, so I need some creatures. Put this in. Uh, I'll put, hi, Ted. <laughs> Hashtag never scoop. I had to. My opponent was just 
going on and on. I'm going to play Pouncing Link. I guess I want all multicolor permanents, but that would be my own too. Okay, I'm going to put this in. It has been a really long time since I've played Limited, so I am just feel like I'm out of practice. Vampire Opportunist, like, I want it to be good, but I don't think it's good at all. Like, th that, its ability is way too expensive. Okay, what about this? This is fine. Uh, Dreadhorde Invasion. At the beginning of your upkeep, you lose one life and amass one. Whenever a zombie token you control with power 6 or greater attacks, it gains lifelink until end of turn. Oh, good lord. Well, we're going to put that in. I'm probably going to kill myself. Our, our lord and savior Marshall says scooping is bad. I can't help it. Mm. As an additional cost to cast a spell, sacrifice a creature. Okay, I'm going to put that in. Dusk Mantle Operative, sure. Um, Vraska's Finisher. Still damage this turn, sure. Okay, let me look at my red. Um, oh, I have a Jaya. Venerated Fire Mage. If another red source you control deal damage to a permanent player, deals that much damage plus one to the permanent or player instead. Okay, putting that in. I've got two! Okay, I'll put them both in. Sarkhan's Catharsis. Deals five damage to target player or planeswalker. Mm. Mm. Um, let's see, I really kind of like Nahiri's stone blades, I'm gonna do that, oh wait, I need to watch, I need to look and see what I've got, I only have seven creatures, <sighs> okay, we need more creatures, we need more creatures, Murder for a cause. Mm. Wait, trust a Pegasus. Turn creature without flying gains flying until end of turn. Ooh, I like that. Let's do two of those. When Tayo's light shield enters the battlefield, put a 1 1 counter on target creature you control. Eh. Makeshift battalion. Mm. I don't know if I like that. Okay, I'll put this in. I thought I put I thought I put a spark harvest in. Oh, I did. I put one, but I have two. Um. Oh, should I put this in? Hmm. Target player discarded a card. Eesh. Sure, I'll put that in. Whatever. Let's see. Spark Reaper. Sacrifice a creature or a planeswalker. You gain one life and draw a card. Hmm. Oh, you think I should put the griffin in there? Yeah, I don't have that many flyers. Do I? Let's see. I've got the Pegasus. Okay, I'll put the griffin in. Um. Okay. I only have 11 creatures. I still don't think that's enough. Oh, but I have five planeswalkers. Okay, I have 11 creatures. Three instants. I have an artifact. Oh, I think it's a land. Um. I'll maybe take one of these 
J is out. And okay, what kind of removal do I have? Spark harvest. Um D Spark. Vraska's finisher is technically a removal, I guess. Bolus's Citadel. And there's no way I'm going to get to play that card. I guess I'll put this other Spark Harvest in here. Um, and... What about this? Gideon's Sacrifice. Um, yeah, I'll put that in. Okay, there we go. I got 40 cards. Oops. Alright, I think my deck is probably pretty janky. Um, I just left the lands that it gave me. I wonder... If I should change any of them. Nope, not doing it. Okay, we're going. That's it. We're just going to start. Here we go. I can only do so much here. Okay, we've got a little bit of a wait time. Um... I guess, you know, there's not as many people playing? I don't know. All right, let's see. Um... Uh... This is not great. This is not great at all, but we're keeping it. It's not great, but we're keeping it. YOLO. I guess I should put some of these fancy sleeves on my decks because I have like a million gems, but I just didn't think about it at all. But I mean, I suppose I should. Hello, Joe. Thank you for visiting. We'll see how it goes. My opening hand here is not good. I don't have any creatures at all. But I didn't put that many creatures in my deck, so... I don't know. Maybe I made a mistake? Oh. Drawing a card. Okay, worth it. We got a Pouncing Lynx. Worth it. We're fine. Yay! We got a kitty cat. Oh, I wish I had gotten some of those, um... What, what's this with the Charmed Stray? I didn't get any Charmed Stray, but I'm pretty sure that's a common. But I really like that card. I think it's really good. Like all around. Oh no. <laughs> She's funny. Sorry, y'all can't hear it. Um and, and equip abilities you activate cost one less to activate. I don't think I have anything that equips. Ooh. Okay, I'm going to Go ahead and get my Pegasus out there because my opponent doesn't have any creatures yet. Uh oh, should I attack this thing? Nah, I'm just gonna attack my opponent. I t I said that person. One attacker. This is Peter C eight seven six. Oh, 
nice. I like this. I like this gleaming overseer. Yeah, I didn't really study up on this set either. So up to two target creatures get plus one plus one until end of turn. Oh, I could do four damage with that. Uh I think I'll do it. Oh, I didn't put a land down, did I? Let's see. I'll attack. I don't I don't care about attacking this thing. Two attackers. Okay. I'm just going to do this. On both of my creatures and we'll do 4 damage. I'm sorry. We'll do 8 damage. I'm not good at math. I've never claimed to be good at math. Okay, that was good. That was good. We did some serious damage right there. Oh no! Okay, we've got a Teferi out here. No! Not my Pegasus! Oh, well Teferi's only got one loyalty now, so we might be able to kill him. <gasps> oh, what's this? Attacks, but only one counter on it? Ugh. Hexproof Menace? Okay, I'm gonna kill this. Or should I just wait? Mmm... I'm just gonna kill this. I'm killing this. Oh, it has menace. I can't block it. Wow, I'm a scrub. I'm a scrub. Oh, this is good. That was dealt damage this turn. Okay, I have to wait to cast that. Oh, but wait, I could deal damage to one of these planeswalkers and then kill it, right? Ooh! Yes, I'm so smart. Okay, so what I need to do... Stop it! Okay, I need to cast this. Okay, I'll ping one. And next... Next. Uh, and then I'm going to... Okay. Uh, I'm going to attack this with this. And this with this. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, we don't need that to fairy. We don't we don't want that to fairy. Yes! He's gone. Okay, next. You're making me grabby. Okay, Vraska's finisher. Destroy target creature or plans rocket point controls that was dealt damage. Oh, goodbye, Merfolk. Goodbye. That's right. Yeah, back to the depths with you, Kiora, Behemoth Beckoner. Okay. Oh no! Oh no! I have to say nice. Oh no! What did they get? They got a Rao and a Cruel Celebrant. Oh no. Okay. 
I have to kill this thing with this. Oh no. Okay. Can I kill this thing with a D-Spark? Exile target permanently with converted mana cost 4 or greater. Yes, I can. Oops. Back to the depths with you, Niv-Mizzet. Yeah, that's right. You're gone. As long as it's your turn, creatures you control have first strike and equip abilities. Ugh. Deals X damage to target attack creature. Oh, wait. I think I could do that. No, I couldn't do that and kill that thing right now. Oh, wait. Yes, I could. Wait, but it's hexproof. Okay. Can I do her minus X on this hexproof zombie? I don't think I can. Oh, I guess I don't have the mana. I'm such a scrub. Obviously. Uh, first strike and menace. So I guess I'll attack. Uh, I'm not going to attack. That countdown timer makes me so nervous. I just don't like it. Um, I need to post on my Instagram that I'm live. But I like haven't had a chance to. Oh no. What did they get? Oh no. Not this guy again. He's actually pretty good. I guess I'll cast a trusted Pegasus. Oh wait, this can do something. Put two one one counters on Dread Malkin. But I don't want to sacrifice my pouncing links. Um I should kill this thing, right? So I could do minus X. Oh, it has to be tapped. I'm such a scrub. Yeah, yeah, I I want to do it on the 1-4, but it has to be tapped. That's the thing. Oh, no. What does he do? Does one damage a target opponent or a planeswalker? E yeah, but I've got my two Pegasuses out now. Pegas Pegasi. No, you're not taking me out. Oh no. You're gonna do one damage to my Nahiri? Oh I'm not even gonna block that. Wait, should I block it? Oh man, I guess they could block this one, right? Do they have something to trick me? Um, they're only doing three damage to my Nahiri, but what if they're tricking me? What if I block with my Pegasus and they're tricking me? I don't want my Pegasus to die. Um. I'm going to do no blocks. I don't I don't care that much about that Nahiri. Like she's fine, but <gasps> Oh, this is good. Oh wait, but I could also do this thing. Wait, no, I have to sacrifice a creature to do that. Or a planeswalker. Oh wait, now I can kill things. I can kill this thing with it. So many options! Oh my goodness! Uh, should I kill this? Should I kill the Rowl with the D Spark? Yeah, oh, 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 okay, 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 okay. Don't worry, I won't wear on your parade. 
Okay, and if I do if I do X damage a target top creature, I need to do three damage. So I could do that. One, two, three. Yes, 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 yes. Next, I'm going to all attack. Target an attacking creature without flying. There you go. There you go. Okay. Oh, wow. They must have an instant. Look at that. Yeah, they definitely do. Oh, darn you. Oh, my creature still got flying. Put two 1-1 one -one counters on... Should I sacrifice something else? That would make it a three. It would do the same amount of damage. Okay. Ah! Uh, okay. I might win this. Honestly. Damn it. This stupid merfolk. Okay, put put out your cool celebrant. That's right. I still haven't posted on Instagram. Okay, I'm trying to right now. Pass. Taking a picture. Okay, I can't block. Pass. Okay, I'm trying to post on Instagram. I'm down to 12. Okay. Okay, I posted. My turn. Okay. Yeah, I do. I have, oh boy. Um so okay. So what I need to do is I need to sacrifice this other creature to put two counters on this, right? No, 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 but I can I can still do five damage. I got this. I got this. Sacrifice this. Submit. So that'll make it a 3-3. Three, three. Next. Next. I'll attack. I don't, I don't want to attack that planeswalker. I got it. I got it. I won! I won! I won with my janky deck! Mm-hmm. Yes! Okay. Oh, I got some gold. Nice. I got one win. Yeah, yeah, I only had one flyer, but I made it happen. Okay, that was pretty good. Okay, let's try it again. Let's try it again. I can't believe my deck has won anything, honestly. It's really bad. R really, really bad. That was probably the only game I'll win. So, you know. You can bluff having a spell to cast by entering full control. No, I can't. That's, that's too fancy for me. I can't do that at all. I can't believe I won! I'm so excited! I tried to like study up on this set. Oh! I brought my magic 8 ball to tell me if I'm going to win the next game or not. Okay. 
Am I going to win the next game? Let's see. The Magic 8 Ball says, As I see it, yes. I am going to win the next game. Woo! Okay, let's see what we got here. Plains, Plains, Swamp, Rising Populace. Ooh, the Wanderer. Wanderer Strike. Pretty sure I did not put that in my deck. How did that get in there? Dreadhorde Invasion. <gasps> Keep. I'm keeping this. I am keeping this. Oh, it's my turn. Durr. Okay. And so, I, I have a surprise for my stream. After this game, I have brought some packs open. I'm going to open up an Ultimate Masters pack. And somebody in the chat will win the rare from this pack. So after this game, we'll do that. We'll do a giveaway. And we'll see. I'll open it up. We'll see what the rare is. And somebody in chat will win it. And we'll explain more after the game. Um, should I do this? Dreadhorde Invasion? At the beginning of your upkeep, you lose one life and amass one. Yes, I should do that. Strike is good. It'll add a counter to the walker. Oh, you can add a counter to your planeswalker. I did not think about that. I did not think about that. Thank you, Efren. Okay, uh, let's see. Whenever another creature rise, put on one counter. Can't be blocked past four or greater. Ugh. You know, we're gonna go with rising populace because I'm gonna. I'll chump block, I'll chump block with my zombies. Ted, if I win, I'm going to eat it on camera. <laughs> okay. Okay, you do that. I really like Burning Prophet. That's actually a good card. It's it's pretty decent. I got Spark Harvest. That's good. I'm hurting. Okay. So... There's the only way to add a counter to uncommon walkers. Wow, you're so smart. I'm really glad you're here because I would not have known that at all. Uh, what should I do? Should I cast this Spark Harvest? Does Sahili target creature or planeswalker? What does Sahili do? Artifact creature token. She's not even that good. But should I do it anyways? I'm gonna get another, I'm gonna get another one of these. <gasps> Stop! I'm just gonna kill it. Choose an additional cost. Sacrifice a creature. This one. Yes. Wait a second. Sacrifice this one. Submit. What did I do? Oh no, I messed up. I messed, I targeted my own creature instead of Sahili. I messed up. I, I messed, I messed up. I wasted my D-Spark. Spark Harvest, whatever. Oh no. Oh my gosh, I wish nobody was watching this so I didn't have to see that. Oh, that was bad. I totally messed up. <laughs> it said target something, so... Oh man. I don't pretend to be good at this game. Alright? I, I really don't. No! They killed my creature! Guess what? My zombie's back. Ooh, this is good. Can't be blocked by creature with power 4 or greater. This is not good. I need some more mana. Uh, I'm gonna cast this. Bleh. I really like this cat. And I really like the flavor text. Don't look at my cat, filthy robot. My opponent's name is Filthy Robot. Rhino, thank you for thank you for continuing to not be watching because I am messing up really badly. 
Oh no. Y'all, I'm telling you, I really like Burning Prophet. It, like, pretty much every turn, it's gonna have its little buff. And then you get to scry one. Oh, is this the thing Sahili made? Oh, yeah, it is. Don't look at my Dreadmulkin. Is that what it's called? I don't know how to pronounce that. What? That was so rude. She said, watch this. And then she killed my creature. I'm, t I'm only dying from my stupid thing. Man, I need some mana. Vraska's finisher and it's about destroying creatures pain on opponent controls that was dealt damage this turn. But I can't do damage to any of them. Because it'll get blocked. Guess I'll just cast this. Oh, uh, no attacks. Okay, maybe I'll just try to get my zombie up to be up to being a 6-6 six, six, and it'll get lifelink. That'll be good. Then I can get some life back. Okay, what does what does Jaya do? If another red source you control would deal damage to a permanent or player, it deals that much damage plus one. That's not good. Oh, but she doesn't count, so it would be a different any other red damage. Okay, let's go. Let's see what you've got, filthy robot. Oh no, the timer's going down. It stresses me out so bad when the timer goes down. Don't forget about this after this game. That's right. We're doing giveaways. Um, my giveaway is not sponsored by Wizards. It's sponsored by me. But the rest of all of the streaming is sponsored by Wizards. My account, all the gems. They've just, you know, done a great job. I can't believe they asked me to do it. Like, I don't even stream. This is my first stream ever. And it's obviously really awful. Wait a second. What just happened? I was going to make that a 6-6. Six, six. But honestly, I'll just get another one back my next turn. So why would you prison realm that? It was only a 2-2. Two, two. Oh, I guess I'm going to have to chomp block one of these. I really hate to do that. I don't have any red mana. That's part of my problem. Yeah, I'm just going to chump block one of them. Hi, Inked Gaming MG. Hi, MTG Strategist. Thanks for hanging out. I'm not doing well this game, but I won my last game. Oh. Pouncing Link. That's good. That's good. I, why am I not drawing any mana? Honestly. This is not good. I'm struggling. I've got several Planeswalkers in my deck, too. I haven't seen any of them. Oh, wait. There's one in my hand. The Wanderer. Whoops. Yes, you have my attention, Sahili. I'm, I, I'm paying attention. Oh, no. Oh, no. What's happening? Oh no! Creatures you control have haste! Oh. I think I'm dead. Rhino, you are more popular than me. And I'm pretty sure there's legal reasons why wizards cannot sponsor you, unfortunately. You are just too young. But you keep it up. You got this. I don't want to kill my zombie. I don't want to. Oh, boy. Four, five, six, seven. Okay. I'm just going to kill as many creatures as I can here. I think this one is over. I think this one is over. I've just had real bad luck with my mana. Ow! Oh, okay, so the magic eight ball, it said I would win. Not true. Um, okay, so now 
Oh, I can claim some prizes. So now I'm gonna open up my chat for my for my ultimate masters, my rare giveaway. Whatever rare is in this pack will go to one person in chat right now. So I'm gonna open up the giveaway. I'm gonna type in chat. Open give give away. And type a number into chat between one and twenty. And then I'm going to roll my 20-sided die, and whoever is the closest to the number that I roll will win my rare. So, yeah, I'm going to take the Magic 8 Ball back. Okay, so type it in chat right now, the number you pick between 1 and 20. And I'm going to leave, and I'm going to leave my giveaway open for just a couple, just a minute or so. And I'm not gonna start my next game yet. So for, go ahead and type it in chat. Type your number. Whoever gets the closest to the number that I roll on here. Okay, and I, okay, everyone in chat, put your number in. No, not closest without going over, just the closest period. Not Price is Right rules. You can go over. Whoever is just the closest at all. Ted. Poor Ted. He wouldn't win anything. I'm not I'm not doing the Price is Right rules. Okay, so I'm going to write this down so I can take notes. I'm not used to doing this. Um, okay, anybody else want to enter the giveaway? I'm going to close the giveaway in about 30 seconds or so. So once I type it in the chat, the giveaway will be closed. I'm going to type closed giveaway in the, the chat. The giveaway will be closed. Here, while, while we're doing this, look at the decks that I've put together. Oh, Rhino wanted me to play. If it's a tie, we'll do a re-roll for the tiebreaker. Okay, we'll do it. If it's a tie, we will do a re-roll with the tiebreaker, with the two tiebreakers. Oh, okay. I need to play my feathers deck. Because Rhino wanted me to play the Feathers deck. And I really want to play that one too. Okay. We will do real. Okay. I'm going to close the giveaway now. So the giveaway is now closed. If you have not typed your number in chat yet, it's over. You're too late. Giveaway closed. Now. Okay. Giveaway closed. Okay. And I'm going to scroll back up. And look at our numbers. Okay. So, first what we're going to do is open the pack. What? We'll just keep re-rolling. We'll just keep re-rolling until it's not a tie. So, first we're going to open the pack and see what's in here. And then we'll see who wins. So, you only get the rare in here. Um, none of the other cards. So, only the rare. Okay, so let's see what's in here. Okay, there's our zombie token. Okay, and I think the one behind this is going to be the rare, I believe. I'm, I'm going to peek. I'm going to peek at it and see. Nope, it's not the rare. It's the flail. The one behind that is the rare. Okay, this could not take all night. Okay, so we've got our zombie token, we've got our foil, and our rare is Rhea Dawnbringer. So our winner will get Rhea Dawnbringer. What else we got in this pack was Boneyard Worm, Plume Veil, and Malevolent Whispers. And then our commons, whatever they are. Okay, so who is going to win? Who's going to win our Rhea Dawnbringer? I'm going to find my 20-sided dice. And you're not going to be able to see this roll, but I promise I won't. I promise I won't cheat. Okay, so I'm rolling the dice. It's a 7. It is a 7. Who got the closest to 7? Let's see here. That's going to be MTG Strategist has won. Yep, got the lowest number. Closest to seven, you have won a brand new 
Raya Dawnbringer. Congratulations. Please message me your address on Twitter and I will get that mailed out this week. Okay, I'm going to write this down. Giveaway number one. Raya Dawnbringer. Our winner is MTG Strategist. This is not rigged at all. So just Ephraim, just don't be like that, okay? It's not rigged. There we go. Our first giveaway is done. First giveaway is down. Might do some more giveaways later. Might not. You're just going to have to stay around and find out. That's how it goes. So, um, what I'm going to do right, should I, should I continue on with my sealed, with my sealed thing? Or play some, um, play something else. I'm going to continue on with my sealed thing. Yep, that's right. I'm going to continue on with it. And we're going to see, okay, now, Magic 8 Ball, are we going to win the next round? Magic 8 Ball last round lied. So, we're going to see, we're going to think that the Magic 8 Ball is going to tell us the opposite of what is going to happen. Are we going to win the next round? It is decidedly so. That means we're going to lose. Okay, let's do it. We've already got one loss. Why not? Let's do it. Sealed deck, one loss, one win. This is the deciding factor. Yes, congrats, MTG Strategist. I'm, I'm going to write it in chat too. Strategist. Please message me your address on Twitter. Okay. Oh, let's see. We got a Gateway Plaza, a Plains. Uh, I'm keeping it. Why not? You know what? I really hate mulliganing, so we're just going to do it. Hello, Coco Lopez. I'm going to say hello because this person is, I don't know them, but they might be my friend. Oh, hello. I'm so glad I got to play one of my friends. Therixis 6. Okay, I can play my Pouncing Lynx if I play this Swamp, so that's what I'm going to do. I, I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna talk about this again. What it? What I'm gonna talk about is my Charmed Stray. I miss it. I want it. I just no. I don't want to play that because I want to play my Martyr for the Cause first. Gateway Plaza. It just makes me nervous playing it. You know, like uh, I like it, but it. It enters the battlefield tapped, and I have to pay a mana. Mm. <gasps> What's this? Spell gorger. Weird. Ooh. <gasps> I got a planeswalker. Do you have the card? Target player discards a card. Okay, I'm. Uh, let's see. I'm 100% casting that. You all cannot hear what he's saying, but it's so good. He says, make this quick. I'm bored already. Maybe I should turn the sound up just a little bit so y'all can hear it. What do you think? Target player discards the card like, I'm doing it. Yes, I'm so sorry, Coco Lopez. <gasps> he said, finish the thought. I'm going to turn the sound up. Can I do it while I'm in the middle of a game? I, uh, I'm going to turn that master up, like, just a little bit. So, oops, oops. Okay, tell me if it's too loud. Uh, I'm going to attack with all. Um, I'm going to turn my own sound down a little bit because it got louder for me. End turn. <gasps> they took it. They took the damage. What did they get rid of? Ooh, a Sarkhan's Catharsis. But that's probably because they don't have the mana for it right now. Oh. A mass two. Zombies, you can draw a trample. Ow. I was going to say oops or something, but. <gasps> Hello, Clint Walker. Yes, Davriel is good. I like him. He's a cool, he's a cool character. 
has an additional cost to cast this spell, sacrifice a creature or pay for it. I don't want to sacrifice a creature right now. Um, so exile target problem with converted mana cost four or greater. I don't think they have any. Wait, they do! Zombie tokens you control have trample. Okay, so I can cast this. I pay one. And then I can also exile this dread horde twins. But should I kill that? Like honestly? Is that worth using my D Spark for? I'm gonna go with it's not worth it. So um okay. Something proliferate. Wait a second. I don't have anything to proliferate! Oh no. Can I give myself a life? It, can I do that? It did nothing! It did nothing! Oh no, I messed up. Oh no. I'm, I'm going to save that. That's an instant. I'm going to save it. Oh my goodness. I just, I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have attacked with that until I had something that I could proliferate. Well, it's fine. It's fine. I've, I don't know what proliferate means. Let's be honest. Oh no. Uh oh. Wait, I can kill this thing with a D-Spark now. Wait, should I kill it before? I should kill it before this happens. Before this resolves, right? Targeted permanent with converted mana cost 4 or greater. Yes, this! I'm sorry, I had to do that. Wait, how does that still resolve? Ooh, I don't understand. That makes no sense. How did that still go through, though? Hmm. Oh, I got a planes. That's good. <gasps> this is good. Exile target creature, then proliferate. Okay, I don't have anything to proliferate, so... Let's remember that. I, I probably need to kill this thing, right? Should I kill this thing? I can pay the mana for it. I'm gonna pay the mana for it. I'm gonna pay the mana. Targeted creature. I messed that one up last time. I cast it. Okay, I did it. And I'm not going to attack because, oh wait, it only has first strike on my turn. I'm such a nub. It's fine. Oh no! I'm in trouble. Oh, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Um, exile target creature, then proliferate. Mm. Mm. This thing, this thing is not good. I don't have anything to proliferate. Okay, I'm gonna kill it with this thing because I don't have an option. It's a too big, it's too big. Confirm the permanent inner players to gain an additional counter. Yeah, summit zero, that's right. As long as it's your turn, Pouncing Lynx has first strike. Um, I'm gonna attack with it. Okay, that's fine. I'll, I'll take four damage in my next turn. That's okay. Uh, oh, okay, this is good. So I can cast this. And I'll have Gideon's Sacrifice. Uh, 
Okay, I'm going to attack with this. Two damage to target creature, and you gain two life. Choose a creature plans to control. All damage that would be dealt this turn to impermanence to control is dealt to the chosen permanent instead. Should I do that to my enforcer Griffith? It'll kill my thing. I'm doing it. This could be bad. This could be bad. Or, or, or it could be great. There's Gideon sacrificing himself. Poor Gideon. But I mean, like, nobody liked him, so it's really okay. I mean, everybody likes Liliana better than Gideon, right? Okay, come on, Coco Lopez. You gotta make a decision here. Oh, no! They're gonna kill my griffin! They're gonna kill my griffin! They'll do all damn. Wait, will it kill my griffin? I don't. I'm confused. I'm confused! Choose a creature or planes where I control all damage. Oh. Oh! It worked! I think they messed up. They messed up. Yes! That was worth it. I think. I don't know. We'll see. I can block these creatures now. Zombie tokens have trampled. Well, I don't care. I'm not upset about that. No! How could you? I, I mean, I'm going to sacrifice that one, obviously. Not my flyer, but I did like my pouncing link. It had first strike. <gasps> my opponent has no cards left. Oh, I need my Devriel now. Maybe I can draw another one. I don't think I have another one. All right, here we go. I think I got this. Well, it just depends on what they draw and what I draw. <laughs> Oh no, I'm taking four damage. What do they have? Do they have something tricky? Yeah, I'm gonna um, block that one and kill it. <gasps> seven to seven. Oh no. A swamp! This is the worst thing I could have drawn. It's fine. I'm gonna act like I have a really good card in my hand. See, I'm doing more damage than them, so I don't need to keep my blocker. <gasps> okay, and then I'm going to keep looking at my hand. Like, look at this. Look at my hand. Look at my hand. Look at my hand. So they think I have something I can play, but... <laughs> it was a land! Oh no, now they know! <gasps> Uh-oh, this is not good. Another swamp! Why?! Uh, okay, I have to... Should I attack? I'll only have one. I should not attack. I should not attack. I'm not going to attack. But I'm going to look at my swamp so they think I have something. I'm going to look at my... Look, I'm going to look at my griffin too so they think I have something. <gasps> Worth it. Okay, I'm going to cast... Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cast this. Okay, and then I'm gonna next. And then I'm gonna all attack. And I'm gonna attack with one. And then I'm going to Rising Populous. <gasps> oh my goodness. This is good. I think. <gasps> no! Oh, no! Oh, that was so good!
good, good job, Coco Lopez. That was a good game. That was actually a really good game. I'm not sad to lose when it's a good game. And I like tried really hard. I didn't get just like destroyed by Teferi or something like that. Oh no, my stream went down. Is my stream down? I need to double check. Okay, hold on a second. Everyone pause. I think my stream is down. Uh, let's see. Hold on just a minute. Okay. Oh, we're still here. Okay. It literally says my stream is offline. This thing is lying to me. Okay, never mind. Never mind. We're still here. We're still here. Um Okay, so I have two losses on my sealed. I guess I'll finish this. Like it literally says your my stream is offline. It, it's freaking me out. Okay, I'm still here. I'm just I'm okay. I'm going to finish my sealed. <laughs> it's okay. It's not that it's not it's not chat. It's like literally it says live stream offline. So that's why I thought my stream was down. It's okay. I mean, y'all can be quiet. It's fine. Okay, I'm going to play my last game. I'm saying I'm going to play my last game because I already have two losses. But maybe it won't be my last game. I mean, maybe I'll win. And maybe I'll keep going. <laughs> okay. I'm going to play. <sighs> my, my sealed deck is not good. So it's kind of stressing me out. But it's fine. It is a fine. So, here we go. I've won one and I've lost two. Oh, oh, I forgot to check my magic eight ball. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay, magic eight ball. Oh, you know what? My magic eight ball was right. It said I would win and we decided that it's gonna say the opposite of what's gonna actually happen. So let's see what it says this time. Magic eight ball, will I win this game? It is certain. Okay, I'm losing. This is it. I am losing this game. Oh, I'm going to keep this opening hand. That's pretty good. This, I it worries me that I never see any red mana. Oh, you know what? Never mind. I get to cast my zombie cat first turn. I really love this cat. I want to see its flavor text, but I can't see it anywhere here. Oh, I don't know. Why? Uh, okay, we're gonna attack with our zombie cat. And that's it. I was just working. Got you on while I day job. It's fine. It's just, it's literally saying that my stream is not, is offline. So that's why. Okay. Oh no, look what my opponent played, Dreadward Invasion. I have that in my deck too. Devriel Shadow. Rogue Shadow Mage. What should I cast? What should I cast, everyone? Should I cast my Davriel? They're nowhere near having less than, less than that many cards, so I'm gonna cast my Rising Populace. And I'm attacking with my Zombie Cat again. <gasps> They're damaging themselves. Okay. Ooh, look at this. Green, white, and black. That's pretty, pretty 
good. Um, okay, so this time, what is this? Centaur Nurture? You gained three life. Ugh! Okay. Hmm. Well, that seems rude. Should I do this? No, I'm gonna do this. And... <laughs> can can y'all hear Davriel now? I turned the sound up just a little bit. He is like... I don't know. Real fancy. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Target player discards a card. Target, discard a card. A mind is a terrific thing to waste. A mind is a terrific thing to waste. That's what he said, if you couldn't hear it. I forgot to say hello to Lycan. I'm gonna say hello. And no attacks. It may be a little bit late. I hope they don't think I'm being rude. <laughs> pretty, 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 pretty good. That is, um, that is a little quote from a TV show I like to watch called, um, somebody help me, somebody help me say, what show is this from? I can't remember. You guys, help me help me say what show this is from. Ooh, Nissa, who shakes the world. I really love her art, like her stance. She's just like, don't, don't, y'all don't. Why are you taking my dad, Riel? Three, four, five. What should I do? I mean, I'm just gonna let him get killed. I don't care. Goodbye. Oh, I didn't realize that would give my rising populace. It says Planeswalker. I'm such a scrub. It literally says Planeswalker. Oh, here we go. A curb your enthusiasm. That's right. That's right. Y'all are so smart. Y'all are so smart. It's such a funny show. Okay, here we go. Menace and... Rising populace. <gasps> Ooh, should I attack with all? Yes, I will attack with all. Oh, wait. Uh, do I want to attack this Nyssa? Put three 1-1 one -one counters on a target creature or land you control. Untap it if you can... <laughs> Whatever. I don't care. I'm just going... I said the... I said the person. Yeah, curb your enthusiasm. That's right. It's really funny. They're taking so much damage from their enchantment. Dreadhorde Invasion. Please don't kill my Enforcer, Griffith. Ted told me to draft that card, and I did, and I don't want it to die. Oh, also, if you if you all see, I'm wearing my Card Sphere shirt. My new Card Sphere shirt. Because Card Sphere is the best place to get your Paper Magic cards. And... It's where I put up all my paper magic cards that I don't want anymore because they're probably blue spells. Um, so you should check it out, cardsphere.com. It's great. I don't understand what's happening here. <sighs> okay. Y'all have got to know, I don't, I can't keep up. Okay, I'm paying one. Here. Should I Nahiri's Stormblade something? Okay. What I'm going to do is attack with all. And what I'm going to put Nahiri's... Oh. I could put Nahiri's Stormblade on both of my creatures. So what I'm going to do is attack with all. This might be a really bad idea. But I'm doing it anyways. And then I'm going to Nahiri's Stormblade all of my creatures. <gasps> They're triple blocking! Okay, wait. So my thing is doing three, right? Three. My thing is doing... my. Ooh, how much damage is my creature doing? Uh... Hi, 
Hi, the spike feeders. What is up? Thanks for coming to hang out. Oh wait, my creature's doing four damage, four, five, six. Oh, so I can kill both of these forests. I'm doing it. This creature and this creature. That is right. Yes, the forests are dead. <gasps> and my opponent is taking so much damage. Not so much damage, but like one damage every turn. Hey! Oh no, they're gaining life! That... Oh no! What, what just happened? I thought I was winning and now I'm like doing horrible. Oh no. That zombie is gonna be a 6-6 six, six soon. And when it's a 6-6, six, six, it will get lifelink. Lands you control have indestructible. Oh no, the creatures are lands. I'm gonna have to chump block. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Oh no. Um. Oops. What? What now? I took the damage. What are they doing? I have two swamps in my hand. What can I do with that? Okay, well, we're just gonna say good game because I got nothing here. Well, guess what? Guess what? The Magic 8 Ball was right. So the Magic 8 Ball said I would win this game. And we know the Magic 8 Ball lies, so I lost. And there we go. I got my three losses. I got one win and three losses. Wow, my deck was terrible. You know what? It's fine because I had fun. Oh, I've got packs to open. Um, yes, I have packs to open. And that reminds me, let's do another giveaway really quick. So if you're listening, I'm going to type in the chat. Giveaway open. Giveaway open. Now, pick a number between 1 and 20. Well, you can also include 1 and 20. And I'm going to roll a dice. And whoever gets the closest to the number that I roll will win the rare from this Ultimate Masters pack. So my giveaway is open. Type a number in chat. Yes, the eight ball is a minion of Bolas. Type type a number in the chat between zero, between zero and 21. I'm gonna roll the 20-sided dice. Whoever is closest to the 20-sided die will win the rare in this Ultimate Masters pack. So type your number in the chat right now. I'm going to leave this open for just a couple of minutes and I'm going to step away for just a quick moment and I will be right back. So everyone put your numbers into chat while I am gone and I will be right back. When I come back, I will close the giveaway. So you have just a few minutes to type your number.
Okay, I am back, and the giveaway is closed. The giveaway is officially closed. Right now, giveaway closed. Okay, giveaway closed. I typed it in chat, so it's official. I like her used car lot decorations. Excuse me! I'm trying to make this look like a party! And, also, that's rude. I do wish I had one of those inflatable arm things, because that would be amazing. Um, and, thank you everyone for being here to my stream. Let's open the pack and see what the rare is first, okay? So, what I'm going to do is open the pack first, and... We'll find out what it is. Whoever is the closest. Yeah, I spelled it wrong. Okay, it happens. Okay, let's open the pack and see what the rare is. You get the rare. Whoever is the closest. I will roll the die after we look at what is in the pack. Okay, here we go. We see our spark elemental. And we have... <gasps> we have a foil fulminator mage. Not the foil. I'm going to have to clarify the rare, not the foil. Every pack comes with a foil and every pack comes with the rare. So I meant the actual rare, not the foil card. So it will not be the fulminator mage. It will be creeping tar pit is what will be won. Creeping tar pit is what will be won by somebody once I roll the die. Also in this pack, we got a Vengeful Rebirth, a Phalanx Leader, and an Iridescent Drake. Very nice, and there's our commons. So, Creeping Tar Pit will be won by, I'm about to roll the dice, okay, and I'm gonna roll. It's going to be Rolling the dice right now. One. The dice says one. So who who was clo the closest to one? The closest to one is Preston Kyle. Preston Kyle, you have won the creeping tar kit. Tar kit. The creeping tar pit. Please message me on Twitter. Reach out to me on Twitter at PKP underscore magic. And um, I will reach out to you and get your address and we will get this sent out to you. So please reach, reach out to me on Twitter. We'll get this sent out. A creeping tar pit. And I'm going to write it down in my a notepad so I have a record of it. So giveaway number two was a creeping tar pit won by Preston Kyle. Congratulations, Preston Kyle. I'm on Twitter at PKP underscore magic. Just reach out to me. If you don't already follow me, give me a follow. I will follow you back and I will message you and we'll get your address and we'll get the creeping tar pit sent right out to you. And the Fulminator Mage, well, I, I don't know. I don't need that. I guess I'll just get rid of it. Whatever. I don't want it. I'll just throw it out. Just kidding. I'm probably going to put it up on Card Sphere. So if you would like a foil Fulminator Mage, you can go to Cardsphere.com and find the one I'm putting up there. Get it yourself. So, um, okay. So what we have done. We did a sealed event and it was fun. Oh, I have packs to open. Let's open our packs. Let's open our packs. Here we go. We have three packs. To open. Sparky really wants me to open this pack. Look at her. Look at Sparky go. She is freaking out. Sparky, calm down. Sparky. Okay, our first pack. Gems. 20 gems? Y'all. Did you know that you could open a card with gems on it? Because I didn't. Okay, you can you can open a card with 20 gems on it. 
Wait a second. Congratulations, you have collected all rare cards in this set. What? Is this a thing? You have collected all rare cards in this set? Too bad this isn't my real account, and this is my preview account. Thanks to Wizards of the Coast for giving me this preview account. It's already got every single card in the set in it, and it's a free account. They've just so graciously given it to me. So I really don't need this gem reward rare cards, but I need it on my own personal account. You get gems when you get everywhere in the set. Oh. So because the preview account already has every rare in the set, I'm getting gems. I've obviously never had every rare in the set. Okay. So... I wish nobody was watching right now because you're really just seeing how much of a scrub I am. And I'm really sorry. I just... T change the password to the account so they can't take it back. I can't do that. I, I need to text my husband really quick. Okay. He asked me what I want for dinner, so I have to tell him. Um, I also have some friends that wanted to that wanted to direct challenge me. So, oh, I have another pack to open. That's right, I have three packs to open. I got more gems. I I was so excited about it, but I'm such a scrub. <laughs> I'm such a scrub. Okay, I got Hoatli, and, well, I didn't, I had, what was the other one, Narset or something? This is not fun, I'm only getting gems. Oh, look, I got totally lost. Look at Fibblethip or Fibblethop. So, okay, if you're, if you're watching right now, please tell me if you think that this character, this little character's name is Fibblethip or Fibblethop. I need to know if it's an I or an O, because I've pronounced it Fibblethop, but I've heard people pronounce it Fibblethip, and they're probably right because I don't know what I'm saying, and I'm new to, like, this game entirely, but, uh, yeah. Okay, so, whatever. Um, okay, I've opened my pack. Okay, I'm gonna play, I'm going to play my, um, Angel's deck, my feather deck. So let me play. Let me see if I can direct challenge somebody. That's. Um, one of my friends. Because believe it or not, I have friends. Um, hold on, just give me a moment, please. You know what? That's okay. I don't think they're online right now because this event, you know, this event goes for like all day. <gasps> oh, 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 you know what I want to do is buy the sleeves. I want to buy some of the sleeves. Mana sleeve bundle. Ugh. Guildgate bundle. No. No, I don't want that. I want to buy some of the sleeves with gems. But I don't want the Boros one. Oops, no. I want the Orzov one. I actually wish to purchase that. I'm yes. I heard you had some <gasps> oh, apply now. Does it apply to all my cards? Or, okay. Oh, wait, wait. No vowels is weird. Fibble fit is how Marshall Sutcliffe pronounces it. He's the one that sets the pronunciation. Okay, if Marshall Sutcliffe says it, then that's what we have to go with. Fibble thip. All right, that's what we have to go with. Oh, sleeves tab. I need so much help with this game. All of y'all, I need so much help. I need so much help. 
Did I get the Orzhov sleeves? Oh, I got different ones, so I'll get these two. You wish to purchase these? Yes. Acquired. Claim. Um, oh, these are all so cool. That's really nice. Okay, so I'm going to play... What did I say I was going to play? The Angels deck. Why is my why is my avatar Kaya? Oh, because I did the Orzov thing. That's right. You know what? I'll leave it as Kaya. Okay, we're gonna play. Okay, I have a deck called Feathers Tricks. That is what we're gonna play right now. No, I don't want to look at the deck. I want to play it. I'm I'm super scrub tastic. I don't want to practice. I don't want to play Sahili's Explosion anymore because if any of y'all saw that game, it was awful. And I just, I'm so embarrassed. Don't watch it. Don't go back and watch it. Don't, do not go back and watch it. Okay, we're going to play Feathers Tricks. Play! Let's do it. I'm really hoping to get matched up against Megan or Maria from Good Luck High Five. That would be so fantastic and so much fun and i would just freak out i wouldn't really freak out but i would be really excited oh i'm playing against blue j712 so that's okay we're you know what it's not megan and maria but ay 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 oh i got feather <gasps> i want to keep it but i have no red mana you know what? I'm going to keep this because of these Defiant Strikes drawn a card. I have no creatures, though. This is so Sketchville, but I'm keeping it. I'm keeping it. I'm going to say, hello. Hello, Blue J 712 Oh, Stupid instant. I don't have any creatures, so, like, can you not waste my time with this GERD for battle right now, please? Ooh! I thought I could cast a Defiant Strike and draw a card. But I can't. This is not good. This is not good. I need a red. I need a red mana, like, right now. And if I get one, I can cast my Feather. Look at this avatar. This is amazing, honestly. Like, it's so fancy. I love it. I don't even like Simic. We got a pelt collector. Should I Defiant Strike this thing just so I can draw a card? I probably should. Is that so scrubtastic? Until end of turn. I'm gonna do it. Ugh, worth it. Worth it. Okay, good. Whew. Okay, I can cast my feather now. Um. <gasps> wow! This is a good duck. Okay, I'm casting my feather. I'm casting my feather. Yeah, I know, right? That the elf ooze. <laughs> the elf ooze. She just looks so cool. I guess that must be like the special Simic avatar, right? Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. They're adapting. Oh, there's another red. Perfect. Okay, whenever you cast an instance of the Pelt Target, could you control exile that card instead of putting it in your graveyard as a resolve? You do return it again at the beginning of the next end step. <gasps> Put up to one one, at least two target creatures. Target creatures plus one to end of turn. Draw a card. Okay, I'm doing this. I'm doing this. And I'm doing. Put a one-one counter on each of two target creatures. I'm doing this. 
We're going to upgrade two creatures. This and this. I'm scrying. Okay. I'll, I'll just keep that. Sure. Each of the leader. Okay. Very cool. And integrity intervention. Okay. That's okay. I'm just going to attack with all. Ah, Feather is so cool. Like, really cool. Ooh, I did a lot of damage. <gasps> and my Gird for Battle came back. I really like that it puts counters on up to two target creatures. I'm just going to do that every turn. Like, why not? Oh, no. What's that? Proliferate. Oh, this thing's probably going to get a counter, right? Oh. So I guess they'll get to choose. Oh, wait. Oh, they all get a counter. <gasps> Dirty deeds. Ah. Uh. Oh, I'm going to win this one. Because you, we all know that Feather is just the winner of all. What's happening here? Oh, they're having to discard a card, I think. Blue J712 is having to discard a card. Maybe they just don't know which one they want to discard. <gasps> they discarded one of their planeswalkers. Uh, I need to see what this does. Whenever Dreadhorde Arcanist attacks, you may cast target and sorcerer with converted mana cost less than or equal to Dreadhorde Arcanist's power from your graveyard without paying its mana cost. Uh, doing that. Simic with Proliferate is brutal, but it's fine. I, th I think this is a really good deck that I'm playing. Three damage in this No, I don't want to do that. Pass. Pass. My turn. Ooh, Sheltering Light. Okay, I know I was going to get that. Um, Deals three damage on any target and you gain three life. Should I kill this Pelt Collector? Should I kill this ben Benthic Biomancer? Uh, let's see. I think I'm going to... I think I'm going to kill this Biomancer. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm hurrying. Okay. Okay, good, 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 good. And scry one. Should I attack with both? I think I'm going to just to like force it. Yeah, I'm I'm going to. I think I'm going to. Um yeah. So are they gonna block with their new bloom hulk? I'm gonna look at my cards so they think I have something. But I have no mana, so they're probably going to know. I might win this game. I might win this game. Okay, let's see. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is not good. This is not good. I, I'm pretty sure I can kill them next turn. Okay, yep, I'm just going to kill them. Good game, Blue J712. Yes! Ooh, this feather deck is fun. Oh, wow, look at my Kaya avatar. She's so cool. Oh, and I got some gold. That's great. 
Rhino, did you see that game with Feather? Because it was good. She's really good. Um, yep. I won. I won. I won. Let me see if I um, can find it. Are you available for direct challenge? Smiley face. Sending a message. Okay. So, I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, your dad is making a Feather Commander deck. Yeah. Oh, Feather is... Feather is really fun. That was a good... That was a good game. What is this mastery orb stuff? This is honestly freaking me out so bad. I'm gonna play another game with my feathers tricks deck. And we'll see if we get a message back from one of my friends. And possibly. Oh, I'm in a message, Zuby too. Let me know if you are up for direct challenge. Okay, here we go. Let's see, I have two planes on a mountain. Go for battle, reckless rage, ooh. Oh wow, how have I never seen this card before? It's from like Ixalan. Oh, I'm keeping this hand. This is good. I really like this deck. I need to try out the Orzhov Gods deck. Oh, I got Gideon. Well, we all know what happened to Gideon. Eek. Sorry, buddy. Okay, I don't want to cast my Gird for battle when I have no creatures. Oh, I need to say hi to, my, to King Wobby. Hello. I still want to see Megan and Maria. If I could direct challenge them... My life would be, like, so complete. A burglar rat. How cute. Wait. Discard a card? You know what? Fine. I'll discard this card because I don't want to do damage to my own creatures. Wow. I thought that was a cute card. No. Changed my mind. Oops. Try again. Swift Blade Vindicator. I like this card. Double Strike, Vigilance, Trample. Yes. Get it, girl. You're just going to be vindicating all around. Oh, no. My opponent seems to be playing Demir. If y'all know me at all, then you know this is not good. Oh, I can cast my Gideon. Oh, let's do it. Let's do it. We're casting it. Okay, Gideon Blackblade. You're up. No! How dare you? I'm so mad right now. I should have known better. I'm playing against this stupid blue-black deck. I should have known. I mean, if you're playing against a blue anything deck, you should just be prepared for counter spells. Oh boy, here we go. We've got a Jace, and my Gideon just died. Target player puts to cards to the library and draw a card. They're trying to mill themselves. King will be. I should I give the? Should I give my creature? Oh, I should give both of my creatures this this thing. Gird for battle, right? One, two, boom, did it. Now my double strike vigilance trample creature is a two two. Oh, I could. Oh, I could maybe almost kill this. Uh, 
Okay, whatever. I don't care about Jace. You know what? I don't care. You can put your Jace out there. I do not care. King Wolby. Ooh, but I'm playing against a blue-black deck, and so y'all know I'm going to get this person down to, like, one health, and then they're just going to come back and destroy me. They're milling themselves! <sighs> proliferate. Draw a card. I don't... Do they have anything to proliferate? Oh, I guess they're proliferating their Jace. Which is now, their Jace is now at seven. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. I'm gonna have to find a way to kill it. Well, honestly, they've got a ways to go before they can win. Sheltering Light. Target creature is indestructible until I turn. Scry one. I will. All That's a card I should save. Target creature gets plus one, plus zero until end of turn. Draw a card. I guess I'll put it on my... Oh, wait, 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 wait. You may cast target instant or associate card with converted mana cost. Less or equal to dread or a power from your graveyard without paying. Oh, okay, so... Ooh, I can do that. Okay, I'm going to do this to my Swift Blade Vindicator. Counter it. Sure, counter it. You know what? Fine. You know what? Fine. Counter it. <gasps> it was all planes. I'm so glad you did that, King Wolby. And I'm going to attack with all. I don't even care about your Jace. You know what? Mill yourself. Go mill yourself. I don't care. Ooh, should I do the Reckless Rage? Where should I put counters on my creature? Oh, I might put counters on my creature. Yes, I'm putting counters on my creature. Are you going to block? Okay. <gasps> yes! Okay, it's fine. Because they are down to five health. Okay, what are you going to do? What are you going to do, King Wolby? You're going to cast another chase? Oh, good lord. Whenever you draw your second card each turn, but a 1-1 one -one counter on target creature control. <sighs> I mean, fine. I don't care about your stupid rat. I don't care. Sure. Whatever. Okay. You're still pretty far away from milling yourself. Pretty far away. Oh, there's Fibble Fip. Fibble Fip. Fibble Fip. They're saying good game. Well, you know what? Maybe you cast an Instar Shell, put it in your bag, give it to your hand. Okay. I mean, I feel like you're saying good game, like, prematurely. Oh, okay. Or just go. I mean, fine. That was kind of rude. King Wolby, but sure. It's not like I was taking a long time. Whatever. Okay, what what is this? I just don't understand what this mastery tree thing is at all. I really don't, I don't understand it. And I don't care about it. If you know someone you want to play with, you can challenge them here. Oh, thank you, Sparky, for telling me. I do know someone I want to play with. 
but I'm not sure that I've heard back from them yet. Oh, okay, hold on. I've heard back from one of them. I don't have any decks, but I am dumb. Message me. And what should I play next? Anybody have any suggestions? Here are my decks. Okay, let's go over my decks again. Not the starter decks. No, 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 no. Not the starter decks. Oh, our Wars of Aristocrats I haven't played yet. Sahelia's Explosion I did play and I hated it. Um, you know what? I think... Oh, Abzan War might be fun. I think somebody's mowing outside. But it's fine. I just hope you can't hear it. Um, I'm going to play... You know what I'm going to play is um, Orzhov Gods. Yes, let's try this one. I don't want to edit the deck. I'm going to play. And I'm going to pick. Um, Where is it? Oh, right here. Orzhov Gods. Let's try this one. Okay, let's do it. Hi, Eric. Yes, I had stopped for a bathroom break, but I'm streaming like nonstop for eight hours straight. So it's necessary to take a bathroom break. Unlike when you do like a one hour stream, that's kind of excessive. Just kidding. I'm not, I'm not judging you for how many times you go to the bathroom on stream. I mean, gotta do what you gotta do. Whatever. Okay, here we go. I'm not playing against Megan or Maria. That's okay. Um, all right, let's see. Oh, I've got God Eternal Oketra. She's so good. Midnight Reaper, that's good. Another Midnight Reaper. This is not a great opening hand, but I'm keeping it. Because that's what I do with all of my not great opening hands. I keep them all. That's, that's how, that's how I do it. Um, I, I'm just going to cast my Godless Shrine and not pay two life. I can't cast anything anyways, so there we go. Please, no, I'm playing against another Demir deck. Oh my gosh. I just had to play against Jace. Two hours, okay, well... I'm pretty sure I was streaming for two hours, over two hours, before I went to the bathroom. Are they actually in the preview event since they're in London? That is a good question. I'm not 100% sure. I mean, I'm sure they were invited, but are they actually participating? I am not sure. That is a good point. But I'll be really sad if they're not, because this was my one and only chance to get to play against them. But that might not be. I don't know. I didn't think about that. We'll see. We'll just keep trying. Okay, so I can't cast anything yet. Midnight Reaper. I guess I can cast that soon. Thief of Sanity! No, I do not want to play against this deck. Oh my gosh. Uh, wait, I want to put a plane stone. No. No, 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 no. I do not want to play against this. Oh no. They've got some red mana too. Oh gosh, this is a red, blue, and black deck. Thief of Sanity, please, no. I wanna be able to cast my gods. <sighs> yeah, I can't block it. Yeah, I can't block it. Take my cards, just take them. Whoops. They're taking my cards, oh no. 
Yeah, Thief of Sanity is such a good card. I don't like playing blue, but if I have to play blue, I mean, I want to play with Thief of Sanity. Oh no, what did they put in my graveyard? Tide Taker, D Spark. Oh. Shoot. This is not good. This is not good. I can't cast my gods like anytime soon. Oh boy. Okay. What? Uh, okay. I think it's, I think it's still your turn. Okay, my opponent's name is Ogatenos. What? No! Oh, I have way too much mana here. But actually, I need, I need a bunch of mana. I guess I need a bunch of mana. Well, guess what? You killed my Midnight Reaper. Here we go. Here's another one. It's not a, it's not really a great card, but sure. That's all I've got right now. But you know what? Next turn, I am casting my God Eternal Alketra. Or should I cast my God Eternal Bantu? Sacrifice so animal permits and draw that many cards. Hmm. Whenever you cast a creature spell, create a 4-4. Ooh, but I don't have any other creatures. I got a Liliana! How did I not even pay attention to that? I am so dead. Thief of Sanity has Thief of Sanity has gotten in two hits now. Maybe they're just getting terrible cards. I don't know what's in this deck. This is a deck that Thyrixis 6 built. And if you haven't checked out his YouTube channel, you totally should. He... Oh, what did they put in here? Another Tithe Taker? Yeah. He builds a ton of decks for Arena, like, all the time. And he puts out a ton of videos. And they're really good. This is this is one of his decks for War of the Spark. So, I played, I played against him earlier, and pl he was playing this deck. I was playing a different deck, and he... He beat me. But, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to No! Another Thief of Sanity? Oh my gosh. Y'all, I'm so dead. What does Soren do? Oh. Okay. Should I cast my God Eternals? Or... Cast my Soren. Okay, I'm gonna cast my God Eternal Bantu first. Because he has menace and I wanna be able to get him out there. Wait, do I have to? Then draw that many cards. I don't want to do that. I wanna submit zero. Okay. Never mind. Uh Okay, and I'm going to attack with this, so they're either going to have to sacrifice their Thief of Sanity or just take three damage because, ouch, yeah, three damage, ouch. Are you ready for that? Are you ready for that? Oh, gate nuss, 23. They took it. They took it. Oh, boy. This is not good. This is so not good. I don't even know what cards they have. I do have a Liliana, so that's cool. Okay, and I have a direct challenge for after this game. Oh, I can't block! Oh boy, this is not good. Um, let's see. They are looking at my cards, like, they're gonna cast all my cards. This is really bad. Is that another Tithe Taker? They've literally discarded a Tithe Taker every time. That's amazing. That is amazing. Okay. And they have cast a Hunted Witness. I don't care about that. Okay, wh Oh, that's my card. Okay, I was like, hold on, they have no white mana. How did they just cast that? That's my card. They got a Hunted Witness. That is adorable. 
Okay. Should I cast a Liliana? Each player sacrifices two creatures. Oh, I could do that right away. Oh, wait, but then I have to do it. Okay, never mind. Turn that creature card with converted mana class. Gained lifelink. Okay, I could get some life back. Uh, okay, I'm going to do this. Okay, I'm casting Soren. Please don't counter it. I forgot about counter spells. I forgot about counter spells. Mm. He's out. Okay, so what we're going to do, does one damage target player or planeswalker? Hmm. Return target creature with converted mana cost X. I don't, I don't want to do that. Okay, I guess I'll just plus one him and do one damage to target player. Yes, I'm plus, yes, I'm plus one-ing him. Wait, it's a plus two? Pfft, okay, it's a plus two. I don't know what I'm doing ever, obviously. My creatures have lifelink. Oh, and they can't block my god eternal bond too. Okay, you know what? This might be fine. Because literally one of the cards they picked was Haunted Witness. That's really sad. This is so good. Okay, this is so good. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Are you going to block with the Haunted Witness? I mean, you should. You should chump block. That's not even your card. That's my card. That is my card. You're not even chum blocking? Why? They must have something. Right? <gasps> oh, <coughs> they took my mortify. Uh yeah, I want to put it in my li my library third from the top. Yeah, I want to do that. Heck to the yes. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, let's see. I'm going to... Wait, is it my turn? Oh, it's my opponent's turn. I just attacked. Wow, I'm so scrubtastic. Oh, boy. Two, I'm going to get two more Thief of Sanity attacks. So that's not good. But honestly, I'm doing fine. Um, we're okay. My opponent doesn't know what to do. They're just scared. You've got two thieves of sanity. Just attack with them. I cannot block them. Oh, maybe they want blockers. I can't believe they mortified my god. Well, I've got removal, but my opponent took it with their thief of sanity. They use my Mortify against me. It's not right. It's not right. That's why I don't like Thief of Sanity played against me, because it's my own cards. They're using my own cards against me, and it hurts my heart. No! You did not put my Seraph of the Scales in my graveyard. Oh my gosh. You know what? Do your worst. You know what? Do your worst. Okay, if I can remove their Hunted Witness and then cast my... <sighs> They're doing it again! Then cast my Liliana and minus four her, I can get rid of both of those Thieves of Sanity. Oh, return target creature card with covered mana cost X. Ooh. Ooh, so I could cast Car Seraph of the Scales. Oh, my god, eternal bond to his bug. They've casted my god eternal Oketra. So if I cast it, will it kill theirs? Rhino, thank you for stopping. Bye. I will have fun. I will continue to have fun, and I will hope to see you soon. Um, 
Okay, listen. If I cast my legendary God Eternal Alcatra, will it get rid of theirs? Because you can't have both out, but that is it on the same side or is it like period? Um I'm so scared. I'm just gonna cast my bond too because I'm not sure if would my I'm not sure if my God Eternal Ketra would uh Submit zero. Yeah, submit zero. I don't want to sacrifice any creatures. Okay. Yeah, I'm targeting them. No attacks. Oh, that's an old legend rule. Okay. Oh, well, shoot. I thought if I cast my Oketra, it would just get rid of theirs. I mean, I still might have this. They're going to do four damage to me this turn, for sure. With their Thieves of Sanity. And I just don't know what else they've taken from me. They've got three cards. I hope they don't have a Bantu. That would be bad. Really bad. I am I think I'm going to cast Liliana next turn and just minus two her. Wait, no, I have to sacrifice my own creatures. What am I saying? I don't want to do that. Oh, this is awful. This is awful. I have somebody wanting to direct challenge me. But I am just not ready. Um, yes, it's still my opponent's turn. I really don't want to have to, like, concede, but I need my opponent to hurry up because I have one of my friends who wants to direct to challenge me. <gasps> my Tesa! Why? Oh. This is awful. Black to a zombie creature token. They are really just thinking so hard here. But that's fine. Like, I'm slow. No! I want my Soren back! I want my Soren back! I didn't think I would like Soren that much, but I actually really enjoy him. Oh! <gasps> I'm going to say nice, but I'm actually, like, really sad. Yeah, I'm going to put it third from the top. Ooh, I'm so sad right now. Oh, shoot. I'm just going to do this. And I'm going to minus four Liliana. Okay. I only have one creature, so this might be a huge mistake, but, uh... We'll see. Okay. Oh, they got rid of one of their Thieves of Sanity! And I get to draw a card! <gasps> We're gonna mortify. I don't have enough mana to cast it. Shoot. I need to kill this thief of sanity. No, they have mortified Sorens. Oh no. No. Oh, I'm probably gonna lose this game. Oh my goodness, you you all. This 
this is I thought I was gonna win I thought I was gonna win but I'm not oh shoot just please attack me with all I don't have anything like I have no creatures attack me with all you silly oh this creature has double strike they can kill me six seven eight nine oh, they can't kill me oh they're gonna attack my Liliana all right, that's fine. Okay, thank you. Okay, here we go. I think I might just concede this game because they're taking a really long time and I have somebody that wants to direct challenge me. And I think I've got it. I think I've got this game lost. Yeah, so I think I'm gonna concede. Don't judge me. Oh, but they just took two damage. They're casting all of my cards. Yeah, it's pretty much over. All right, come on. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, I'm just gonna go. I hope they don't think I'm rude. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but you're just taking so long. Okay. Uh, okay, so I'm going to direct challenge one of my friends. Um, copy. Okay. So which deck should I play? Should I play that one again? I'm going to direct challenge Eli of the Veil. And she is one of my friends from Twitter. You should follow her on Twitter. It's Eli of the Veil. Um, I'm going to play. I might just try that deck again. My Orzhov Gods deck. I'm just gonna go for it. I really liked it. Okay, so I'm direct challenging and we'll hope that she comes on here pretty quickly. And I'm really sorry that took someone. Oh, I forgot to check my magic eight ball. Okay, let's see what my magic eight ball says if I'm gonna win this game or not. Magic eight ball, um, it says ask again later. Okay, well, I don't know what that means, but my magic eight ball lies and it says the opposite of, of what actually happens. So, asking again later. Okay, so we're gonna wait like 30 seconds and see if that counts as later and we're gonna ask it again. I really love my Kaya avatar, that's really cool. I don't ever pay like actual money on any of my, um, on my on my actual my real my personal account so I don't have this fancy stuff but on my free wizards preview account I have like a million gems so I just bought all of the stuff well no I only bought the Orzov stuff because I only like Orzov yeah because I'm you know whatever I'm whatever um, okay. So I'm waiting for my friend. She's not coming up here. You should add the sleeves. I didn't know. I, do I have to actually add the sleeves? Or do they just go on automatically? Because I thought they were just automatic. But I don't know. Well, maybe my friend went AFK. That's okay. We're just going to wait here. Um, we'll play a game. Or, you know what? You know what we could do? Let's do another giveaway, but this time it will be a Ravnica Allegiance pack. Let's do a giveaway. Giveaway open right now. Number, number between 1 and 20 in, in my chat right now. Giveaway is open. So I'm going to roll a dice, and whoever gets the number closest to the roll that I make will win the rare card in this pack. 
So, uh, we're going to open Ravnica Allegiance Pack. So, right now, the giveaway is open. So, type a number in the chat between 1 and 20. I'll roll the dice. Whoever's closest, you can go over. It's just whoever's closest. So, while we're waiting for this matchup, we're going to do the giveaway. And um, everyone in chat, type a number right now between 1 and 20. Type it in the chat. I want to know what you've got. So say your numbers, type them in chat. Let's see what you've got. We've already had two winners and the previous two giveaways we had, Efren Q is not a number. Six, okay, that's better, that's better. Okay, she says one second. We're still gonna do this giveaway, like no matter what. But, uh, okay, giveaway is still open. Put your numbers in chat. If you're listening to if you're listening to this video right now, watching the stream, put your number in the chat. You're going to win whatever rare is in this pack. I'm going to go ahead and open it while we're waiting for our opponent. But the giveaway is still open. So, the giveaway is open. And we're going to go ahead and open the pack. See what the rare is. Get your numbers in. The giveaway is still open. Okay, this is a Ravnica Allegiance pack. Let's go to the back. Let's go to the back and see what we have. Okay, this is a token. And this is a Simic Guild Gate. And our rare is Sphinx of Foresight is our rare for this pack. That is a pretty fun card. I don't like blue, but Sphinx of Foresight is fun. Let's see what else we got in here. We got uh, Scrabbling Claws. We got Dovin's Acuity. And we got Dagger Caster. That's a fun one. Okay, very good. Uh, we j and, and we got all our commons. Whatever. Okay, so our rare for this pack is... Sphinx of Foresight, and our giveaway is now closed. So if you have not put in your number, you're too late. Giveaway closed. I'm typing it in chat. It's over. Okay, so now I'm going to roll the dice, the 25 dice, to see who's going to win our Sphinx of Foresight. Okay, here we go. I'm rolling the dice. It is going to be a 10. 10, who is the closest to 10? The closest to 10 was Boltan. Boltan, you won. You you picked 12. You were only two away from 10. You won a Sphinx of Foresight. Please message me your address, and I will send you this card out this week. You are the winner of our Sphinx of Foresight. And now I shall write it down on my list because I have my list going right here. Giveaway, uh, I'm going to write in chat. Congrats, ball pan. I can't spell it. Congrats, ball pan. You won, okay. Giveaway number three is Sphinx of, okay, hold on. Sphinx of Foresight, and our winner is a Baltian. Very cool. That is our third giveaway of the night. And we might have some more, or we might not. So you're just going to have to stay tuned to find out if we do. Um, yeah, so I'm still waiting for my direct challenge friend, Eli of the Veil. You know what? It could be Ellie? Ellie of the Veil? I'm just not sure. Do you, okay, so I know this is a female. It could be Ellie of the Veil. Well, I've just, I don't know why I thought Eli, but I guess it's probably Ellie of the Veil. I've been saying this name wrong in my head for I don't know how long. And... We're just, we're just going to be patient here. We're going to be patient. 
and wait for this direct challenge. Ball's hand, it's a blue card. I'm sorry, I, I don't know if you like playing blue cards or not. When we played arena against each other, you played green cards, but I don't know if you like playing blue cards. I don't like playing blue cards, but Sphinx of Foresight is actually pretty fun. If you get it in your opening hand, it is pretty cool. For sure. Um, yeah, so we're still waiting here. Um, okay. I'm going to cancel this. I'm going to cancel this direct challenge. And, <coughs> excuse me. I'm going to look at my decks and see if my Orzhov Gods deck needs anything changed. I really liked it. I thought it was a lot of fun. Um, it has four Hunted Witness, four Tide Taker, four Cruel Celebrant. I love that card. Four, uh, no, I'm sorry, two D-Spark, three Ministrant of Obligation, three Midnight Reaper, two Mortify, four Seraph of the Scales. I love Seraph of the Scales. Two Soren Vengeful Bloodlord. I didn't know if I would love Soren or not. I do love vampires, but I didn't know if I would love him. But I really do. I really do. Two Tesa. Two Guard Eternal Oketra. Um, two Guard Eternal Bantu. He was fun. Two Liliana Dreadhorde General. That's it. That's pretty good. Oh, okay. We're in for our direct challenge. Let's do this. Play. We're playing. Direct challenging. Here we go. Your coworker has an Azorius deck that can use it. Oh, well, good. Yes, you can absolutely continue to pass it on. Um, that is fine. That is totally fine. Well, I sent mine too. But I'm not, but I'm not, but I'm not, we're not picking this up here. We're not picking this up. Hmm. Um, waiting for your ch opponent to challenge you back. Okay, mine says waiting. Do you think it's bugged? Do you think it's bugged? Mine says waiting. Do you think it's bugged? I mean, we're just we're struggling here. We are so struggling. Okay, we're gonna cancel and try again. Oh, Justin Thibault wants to duel too. Okay. Okay, tried. Oh. I don't know why this isn't working. I mean, I copied. I copied the name, like, exactly. Um, hold on a second. No. Cap no capitals in your name? Because it's like not capitalized at all. Well, shoot. I 
mean, this server could be like sort of bugged. Maybe we can try again later. Okay, well, it is not working. Oh. All right, well, I'm just going to, um, I'm just gonna play some other games. I guess we'll try like one more time. I'm gonna try one more time. Waiting for your opponent to challenge you back. Ugh, it's like just totally bugged out. Okay, so let's just try some more. Let's just try some regular, regular play. What deck should I play next? What deck would you all like to see next? Let me know if there's any deck you would like to see. Here are my decks available. I might try this Abzan Soren's Angels deck. Yeah, she sent me screenshots too. Like she, like the challenge was there. Um. You know, she was, she was, she was putting it right. Like we were both typing in the right thing. I just, I don't know. I guess it could, I mean, there could just be bugs on this server. I don't know. I'm going to try this Abzan Soren's Angel's deck. Let's try it. Let's see how it goes. Oh, Thick Angels. Yeah, I want to try that one too. I want to try that one too. Okay, I'll try to do that one next. Um, and my other friend, Thyrixis 6 wants to direct challenge me too. The, I have played the feather deck. It was it was actually really fun, but I would be happy to play it again. So I will try I will try that one again soon also. But which one which one did I pick? I I think I picked the Randall one. I mean there's no telling. Like Ooh, look at this wait time, y'all. It could be my internet, like just being Oh, well there it goes. Oh, I'm playing against Lost in the Shuffle. Okay, let's see how this goes. Oh, a History of Benalia. I love that card. This is good. I've got I've got mana of every color. A Mortify and a Seraph of the Scales. Ugh. This is not a great opening hand, but guess what? I'm keeping it. Wait, let's see what the Magic 8 Ball says. Oh, wait, it's my turn. It's my turn. Uh, okay, I'm not gonna pay my two life. I'm gonna enter tap. Okay, I can still see what the Magic 8 Ball is gonna say. Am I gonna win this game? Magic 8 Ball says, my sources say, no, that means I am gonna win. Everyone knows that means I am gonna win. Enters tapped, I just don't care. I have nothing to cast this. Oh wait, I drew a Lyra Dawnbringer. Ooh, that's good. Oh no, my opponent is playing. Is it? Oh, why does everybody like to play blue? Ooh, Angel of Grace. That's nice. Except I haven't drawn any additional mana. So that's actually really terrible. Okay, but History of Benalia, that's, that'll, that'll keep me afloat for a few rounds. I'll need to draw some more mana. Oh, my opponent is opting. I have got to remember that they will probably have counter spells. Um, yeah, because they're playing blue. They played a crash through. They didn't have creatures. They're just trying to draw cards. Oh, no. What is this? Wait, what just happened? I have no additional mana. Oh, wait, I can mortify this thing. Okay. Exile target permanent. If I exile it, it's not in the graveyard, right? <gasps> this is it. This is it. Yes. That's right. It's not in the graveyard. 
I forgot to say hello to my opponent. I guess I don't have to say hello, but I just feel like for this special event, I should say hello. Hey! Why? That was so mean, but I'm gonna say nice. Oh, yo, I still don't have any mana! Look at me! <laughs> this is bad! Oh, good lord. Oh, wait a second. I can cast this. Does it have haste? Yes, it does. I'm killing it. Yep, I'm killing it. Yeah, I'm definitely killing it. I need mana, deck. That's okay. I got to respond to Angel. That's cool. <gasps> no! Oh, this deck is the worst. I literally have no mana. I can't do anything. I mean, I can't do anything. Oh, this is frustrating. Oh, my opponent has six mana and I have nothing. Okay, well, I'm dead. Good game. Good game. Good game. I literally have nothing. Okay. All right, well, I lost again. I still don't know what this mastery tree thing is. Like, okay, sure, put this thing in my deck. I don't care. I don't understand what this is. Okay, it's whatever. Now. Oh, wait. I don't want to look at that. Oh, uh, I wanted to add the sleeves to my deck. How do I try to do that? Wait. Um. Okay, so I, so I open the deck? And then... I ch add the sleeves? How? Here? Oh, I see it. I see it. Oh, okay. I put the sleeves on my Orzhov deck. Yeah, I want to save. And... Er, I'll put it on my Orzhov Gods deck, too. Um... Oh, yeah, this one. Or should I do this one? I'll just do this one, because it's different. Okay, I done. Did I do it? Is it there? I just don't even know. Okay. Um Let's see. Okay. Um so I'm going to pause my stream for a little while and um, go eat some dinner and come back in a little bit. So, um, I will probably be back in less than an hour if y'all want to join me again for the rest of the evening. That would be lovely. But, um, I'm going to take a break right now and I will see you all later. I will probably do some more giveaways later. So be sure and join back. Thank you so much for joining this one. And yeah, hope to see you again in just a little bit. Bye!